Hello, hello everybody, Hexanta here, welcome to episode 5 of the Tomb Kings Let's Play, playing Acetra the Imperishable. So we are here at a very pivotal moment in this campaign, we absolutely have to take the Black Tower of Arkhan, we've got no time, things are happening. So we've got two stacks here, one good stack and one terrible stack, so we're going to have to do it. And, uh, yeah. Alright, so that's quite a small amount of wall space, which should in theory reduce the amount of physical towers that they have there. In theory. I've got some slightly better units than me. I've not got any Ushpati, Ushapti with uh, Great Bowers or whatever they're called. Uh, right. Probably focus on this side with the only two towers that I've got. One for each wall space. Everyone else. I'll put these on. Get off skirmish mode. It's got a lot of random units here, and I'm not overly impressed by them. Um what the Cambrian Wall Sphinx got the front line Sh T probably to help. Sepulchral Stalkers. Not what to do with them, probably put them up there for now. Um Cavalry and Chariots. Again, like until they can be used, put them over there. Uh yeah. Not an amazing situation. Block of Jeff. Or Jeff. <laughs> uh dear. Alright. Send Cetra as well. But yeah. Don't know if that'll work. Try and wreck this tower. Ah, just go off the skeleton archers. It's probably a better plan. Nah, they can't go quite as far, can they? How are we doing on damage? That one's pretty bad. But I think it should still survive. In theory. Ah, oh, Tomb Swarm, not good. Gate yeah, should get wrecked. So it is getting damaged. I severely doubt it's going to get destroyed though. Try and get them up that side. These guys can all get ready to burst through the gates, which they are. Stay on there. Oh, these guys can come in. Where's. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot about all of these guys. Because I'm really bothering about them. And the archers, apparently. Oh well. Who needs. Who needs any of them? Right, guys. Burst through. Is there anything? It's a hex area. Hex all these enemies. This is a single combat. It's not good, isn't it? My orders enacted. 
Cool, cool. Oops. Didn't mean to move the artillery. It's kind of fine where it is. Back in there. Worth doing that, try and get more of our units on the walls. Spawn in the unit. Explosion. Let's do that hex again. Bringing them down. Make them useless. Clock of Jaffa having problems here. Don't want to falter. Gone, Wall Sphinx. You gotta go. Can't remember if he's just anti infantry or not. Oops, let's do that. Oh, yes. Great King! Do as I say! Uh, what else? Augment myself. Try and keep up the attack. Burst the enemy, push them away. Like I'm trying to focus on the Tomb King here. Bring him down. Oh, I just sent <laughs> Setra flying. <laughs> oh my god. Oops. Not exactly the best. Oh dear. Shot two of great balls. Don't deal with them because they're going to hold a massive amount of damage. My orders. Kill him. What are you doing? You need to come help. Got a job to do, mate. Try and kill him. Because I think mostly, apart from them two, can probably move on now. To the centre. They're gone. Obviously, the wall sphinx, I might as well send over there. Cetra and Patmos can deal with him. All these can swarm in if they want as well. Just go. Bring him down. Any of these actually good at the moment? Keep 
it up. It's one of the tomb small, aren't they? Get another unit of Shabbatian. Help them out. That's got catapults off again. In them right in the face. Their Tomb King's almost dead. There he is, dead. It's certainly going to help. Our situation. Just get everyone in now. We haven't got time for pleasantries. All my archers. Get ready to shoot. I'm worried about my more sphinx. Yeah, all there. Go on. Get out. Survive! Survive! But we really are trying to kill him. I can't lose him. There we go. Send the archers up there, I guess. Not a heal spell sector, is there? Is there a vortex though? Spawn this on them. I've not seen it before. Oh, there's a sandstorm. Oh, it's just, yeah. It's still not amazing, but uh, better than nothing. Get my flock of Jaff back in. But they're getting absolutely minced by the uh, critical binding now, so that is it. We've done it, but we've probably lost more units than I would have liked. Killing him early is definitely what you need to do, but I've lost her. Shapti, I've lost a Nehkara Horseman unit, and I've lost a Nehkara Warrior unit. Not great. But I think, if I'm not mistaken, this settlement had decent kind of buildings that we can repurpose for our glorious empire of kings. if I wasn't mistaken it is so occupied we were getting interest from the followers in the gash right so get two more ship T units Rises from the sand. So, yeah. Do not betray your king. I, I am a true ruler of Nehekara. Uh, what do you offer? They're not interested at all in peace. Nehekara rises from the sand. Cross miles. 
Let's trade. Fine, but can you still trade with me? Oh my god. I'll try them next turn then. If they're happy with military access. Right, so that's just ranked up. Conquer of the past. Una experienced local recruitment capacity. Founder of Kemri. Hero capacity for Tomb Princes. Your recruitment for Tomb Princes. Unit capacity for these guys. Oh, yes. I have works greater than their patron. We can get more Tomb Garden stuff. But it's kind of like, why have I got that when I could have a tier 3 main building? But, you know. Attend your king, slaves. That's the thing, though. I'm getting... Two there. Oh, that's fine. I'm getting two and two. Um, but obviously... I can get rid of you, you, and you to get you, you, and you in this unit, in this army. Lots of screaming skull catapults I can get, so I can get rid of you. Get you. And the Hikaru horseman unit that's on his own. I alone shall restore the Hikara. Cool. That's better now. Nice. I don't know what the Falls and the Gash are going to do. Heroes not moved. I need more. Can I stop this army? Nope, apparently I cannot. Massive failure. Oh dear. Well, they're besieging. I mean, if I can get peace with the Rakaf dynasty, I need to try. But I don't think they're particularly bothered. And I don't know if they're at war with uh, Ark and the Black. Or not. His burial shrine is very small. The char calls. Tomb King of Nehekara. Now we go. I rule everything. I rule. For Nehekara. No. It's not great, I have to say. a chance but I kind of want them to siege me but I also want to try and get this army Serve me. over but unfortunately that means sacrificing some of my units to be only be able to get ones that take one turn to recruit one of these guys I can't really do anything else. Such a tiny pyramid. No, there's no point in doing that. I can't embed him into Cetra's army. You dare challenge an ever living priest king of Nehekara? Eh. They're not interested. Uh, how about Tomb you? Are in the court of a king. No. Oh my god, would you just trade with me, you bloody fool? Never. Oh my god. Let's 
clearly they're all upset with me for some reason. They're going to do the famous bloody attack the secondary army. I'm going to retreat and they're going to attack my main city. No? Okay. Right. Well. I'm not sure we're going to win. But if I can kill their lord, focus on him entirely, everything else hopefully could fall to dust. I think he's just a recently recruited king as well, level 1, whereas my king's slightly more upgraded. We've also got the archers, which I'll only shoot him with. And go from there, I think. Right. Don't think I've really done any damage to him yet. Trying, failing. Just please don't get caught. Can you actually fire on him, please, and not those? Very helpful. Okay. Got to turn around. Now ignore. I should be able to deal with him on my own now. Work. Make sure we're only firing on him. Hopefully we're gonna win this engagement. Leave him alone. My orders. Animals. Okay. Just need to help myself here. Sepulchral stalkers can do one. Get ripped. Looks like I'm not exactly winning against that. Don't know if any shots are helping or not. Okay. Initially, I was like winning without a doubt. Now, not so much. Don't know why. It's not him winning against me. Nope. 
It's not particularly worked too well in my favour. Everyone's not having fun. Well, we had it until they brought in the friends, unfortunately. Just not quite getting there. The sepulchral stalkers Agreed. ruined my day. And everyone else is going to uh, falter. Unfortunately, let's fast forward now, so. No bothering with it. We're done. Close defeat, but I think we've not really taken out any of the units of consequence. Yep, only second out of three units. <laughs> I try my best. Does mean they can get back and help against the Tower of Arkan. It's not the best occurrence. Aggression pact with whoever this is, the Tawathis refugees, I'll accept. <laughs> Ugh. Reinforced temple, please. Such a tiny pyramid. <laughs> Such a tiny pyramid. And it's only him at the moment. We're weakened. I guess Spirit Leech. I feel like... It would be difficult to take out Arkan with this. Glory for Henry. It's slightly worrying, because next turn they're just going to get in and attack anyway, so... Yeah. King Araru is ready for duty. I can spawn them in. Uh, I have works greater than their patron. Attend your king, slaves. I don't know, I might I might have to think about recruiting. These. My dynasty reigns supreme. Well, it took two turns anyway, there's no point. Could rank that up. Ah, oh, I think it's because that build, didn't it? That we got that. 
Um. Say so I could. Can we to rank four? Yeah, go on then. Get Araru back. Just in case we need him, which we probably will. And just wait till next turn to be able to get more units in. So if we're lucky, our enemies will attack Arkan, but I seriously, like, severely doubt that's going to happen. Are they going to help or are they going to try and break the siege? That's I don't know. Help as in help Arkan and not me, obviously. Sand and stone. These elements are everything. They will be your epitaph. I can send as much money as I like against them, but still don't like me. Apparently they're not in range. That's annoying. But in theory that means that Arkan shouldn't be in range of Blasmissas either. In theory. In practice I'm not quite sure about. I think Charix is still terrible, in my own humble opinion, but gotta be better than nothing, right? This agent has been absolutely worthless this episode. <laughs> absolutely crap. Yeah, so they're coming to fight me here, which is fine because I'm going to do that and lose nothing. Take out their entire army. Find the souls. He's going, uh, uh, about that. Bye bye, Arkan. It's nice knowing you. Bye bye. Cool. That has worked way more than I thought it would. Is he coming to siege me now? Ugh. That's annoying because he's probably going to crest the attack right now. Well, maybe he can't. Okay. His burial shrine is very right. small. I have risen. Attend your king, slaves. The greatest art. Get my chisel. Oh, success. What the hell? We've got even another stack over there. Alright, I'm gonna order this. I know it's like probably not amazing to do so, but I need to do it. Okay. Right, what shall I send over? To Cetra. So I kind of want to make Cetra's army like the best, so you can take all them. 
Uh, oh, I can keep a, one of them, can't I? I'll try to transfer too many over. Move that over because I'm not bothered. One sec. Before I do this, stop recruiting you so it's 13. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. It's made one full stack here. Rank 3, Domus will will. 18. Nope. Still not interested. King of kings. It's like you're pawing, isn't it? Uh, do I have another unit? Army. Lob. Beep, beep, beep. Ability, yes. Who, though? One turn. I'll wait one turn for him, then. Something like boosts Tomb Guard. That one gives you armor and weapon strength. I'm sure one of them gave you more against Tomb Guard. Not just that one. Ability Death Blow for Tomb Guard units. Herald of Mahrak. Let's get him. Mm -hmm. Right, I'm hoping no one will siege me yet. But we do really need to. Uh, push on, get four stacks, hopefully with decent units, and just smash the enemy to pieces. Nagash is rightfully running away, tail tucked between his legs. June Kingdoms, I want to try and get some sort of friendship with them, at least for now. Yeah, they're thinking about going after Zandri again. But we are slowly whittling them down. My hat is ready for duty. I've got the Herald follower faction. Follower to our faction, should I say. Herald of Mahrak. Um, there we go. He should smash it, these guys. Too long for them. 5k. Obviously I'm thinking about maybe a tomb scorpion. I can get two of them. It's not actually that expensive. That much? Oh well. Black Tower of Arkan. But yeah, Xandri unfortunately is going to bear the brunt of their wrath at the moment. I'm going to try and go over to. Who am I trespassing against? Oh crap. Oh crap. <laughs> Why did I move Cetra? Yep, that's not what I wanted to do. I think we should be okay though. He says. Let's 
Let's go catapult buffs. Yeah, so I kind of made an error there, but it, it happens to everyone. I mean, it's not the worst error I've ever made in a Total War series. Believe me. I've moved an army in a worse position and got it lost in result. But even if that army could attack me, which I don't think it can anyway, the strength of that army that I have is powerful enough. But they're going to attack Xandri. I can't do anything about it. Now are they going to sack it or are they going to take it? They're going to sack it. Again. Oh, they are going to take it. Okay. That's what you want to do. More slaves. I need more. Sintra the imperishable. Nothing pulls the despair. It's got a good garrison now. This is forbidden. I make one. Ideally, I what I need to do is attend your king. Get another stack with these guys. I've got four and a Hekara warriors that need to be utilized. Skeleton horsemen as well. I aren't using it at the moment, but it's fine. It's a tier four Gemri. And just can almost get a scorpion's nest. Can get some two scorpions on the field. That would be absolutely mint. Shall be a glorious day for Setra. Oh, the Tarithus refugees got wrecked. Oh well. They gave me some money for non aggression, so I'm not too worried. The gods. Oh, they got wrecked. They've yeah. Are oh, you gonna be friends now? Well, we could be friends. And you can trade with me to get me more money. Okay. So. Mr. Tomb Scorpions. It takes six, six, six turns. I have arrived. Okay. Can move that way if they want. My dynasty reigns supreme. They are oh my god, this age is so bad. <laughs> uh, just don't. Just, just don't. Right, there's another army I can build and should build. But I'm just trying to quickly get the ability to deal with the pools of despair. Because they deceive with one army and they attack the kind of stragglers with the other. Which should work because I can siege with this second army, the Black Tower of Arkan, and then I can attack with Setra and make sure we've got the power to deal with them. So they are coming in to attack. Although a similar story to last time, I'm not sure why it's giving them such a good chance. Especially now I've got better units. 
Right. Well, I'm going to have to leave it there for the moment. Hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like if you did. We don't have to. Just like button right next to it. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more. Follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Hacks on Tom both. And join the Discord community. Link is in the description as always. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.